Take us to the pass. Uh. Because you rogues have bullied me for jazz. the last time. That's my, my, my two all attribute ornate jazz. Oh, you're stacking plus all? Oh, yeah, you definitely gotta die now. Alright, have a lovely day, sir. Hope you're doing okay. Follow. Yeah, today we're making a axes video because the axes in this game, people sleep on it, but you trade like a, a little bit of range for extra swing speed. It just does so much damage, it doesn't matter what gear they're wearing. Oh yeah, and if people wear a shadow mask, it's not even any effort. This gives you no head protection at the cost of stats. So, if I had Executioner, this would happen way more often. Take it back! Yeah, Rogue. Yeah, Rogue. Come on! <laughs> Man, two-tapping Rogue is always going to be funny. Doesn't matter how geared they are, they'll just get two tapped. So on the people on YouTube, if uh, me telling you isn't going to convince you, uh, let me just show you numbers. Alright, if that doesn't convince you of course. I am wearing good gear, but as people know, I don't buy gear off the market. So everything that I'm using is what I kill off players and use. That's why I don't really make a build video of what I buy. Because I only use gold for meds and weapons. So let this go to show for people who like to wear high levels of gear. A double axe will literally just straight up one tap a lot of magic users. The double axe excels at killing people who don't have a lot of head protection. It's one of the only stats in the game that you can't just invest in a modifier. So keep that in mind. the magic missile. PG. Use the rage of the last second to dodge the hit.
He aimed straight down. Good on him. No mercy. No, you killed Cave Troll, you monster. He had a family, so no, you don't get spared. Yeah. Have a lovely day. Barbarian! Get him, my goblins! Get him! Kill him! Kill him, my goblins! Yeah! Kill him! Get him! Yeah! On your big burger, fall. Thank you. Thank you, Apollo. What the bar doing? The bar's got a knife. All right, have a lovely day. Keep dodging. <laughs> GG. I took a lot. How's it going? Hey, uh, lovely day. Yeah, yeah. 
Okay, have a lovely day, sir. I'm literally staring at you. Alright, have a lovely day, sir. There is someone. I saw your lantern. Let's go. GG. Put you away, put away the Francescas. Throw hands. You are not skinny Pete. Wait, uh, wait, are you skinny Pete? Hold up. Stop running. Get back here. <clears throat> Have a lovely day, sir. When you're fighting Slayer fighters, it's usually a good idea to use both Blood Exchange and Achilles at the start of the fight. Usually you want to wait until the mid-fight to get back health. But when stuff can be like high DPS, like Slayer fighters, it's a good idea to get the lifesteal early. Okay. If I didn't use it at the start, I would have been dead. What the bard doing? <clears throat> what the bard doing? What 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 the bard doing? <clears throat> Why won't you tell me your secrets? Why are you hiding from me, bards? You all choose death rather than just tell me what you're doing. So clearly you guys are hiding something. I will eventually find out what you're doing. I will always keep asking. <laughs> 